Damn. Scroll down, you should be able to pull it up on here. Actually, go go out of that page. Yeah, there, no. there you go. Watch live video. Should be able to pull it up on here. On YouTube. Actually, go, go out of that page. Watch that video. Yeah. How they look? How they make it big, though. Sure. How they look? Scroll down real. Use the right. How they look? Nothing. You scroll. You go right and watch. Use the Turn and look. Now I'm about to turn and look. Oh, wait. Oh, we here, man. We here, though. 
So how's your week been, sir? Man, it's, it's, it's been okay. Like, honestly, the last three days I actually felt good, man. Oh, damn, that's what's up. That's like, it's, and it's crazy because not only like I felt good, but the fact that I acknowledged, like, damn, I feel good. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, it, 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 I felt like I just made it through a storm, bro. So, I'm, I'm, I'm all right, man. I can, you know, it's, it's been a it's been a straight week for me. How about yourself, bro? Man, it's been straight, man. Just uh, just working, chilling, trying to beg my son to come home to see me. You know how it is. You'll see. You'll see how that is. Hey, that's a whole other can of words. <laughs> hey, <Look. laughs> hey I, I, I almost spilled the, spilled the beans, the rice. The goddamn <laughs> collard greens and everything, but I'm not. So I mean, you know, we yeah. see you just had senior night the other night, right? Man, senior night, man. And uh, soon he's gonna be going off to school. Those Damn. text messages and conversations, it was further and further Shh, away. Man, hey, that's what I'm saying, parents. If you listening right now, check in, tune in, man. Express how you feel having a grown child and Ooh. and and fighting to have a relationship with them. And being a parent with a grown child, but yet you're grown and your parents still treat you like a child. Come on, man, talk that's to us. Right. Right. That's, that's, right. that's, that's, that's it, right? Talk that's to us. Talk to us. That's it, right? We, we at that age right now, yeah, right? Take this hoodie off. Yeah, man. Hey, this rated, this rated what? Uh, y'all about to see it. Go swear up. Go swear up. Yeah! Hey. I'm gonna turn my head. Man, turn my head. Woo! 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 There it is! <laughs> hey, it is what it is, man. I'm fat. Y'all see me with the shirt on, oh, it don't matter, shit, bro. Man. But yeah, man. Oh, oh, shit. That shit rough, though, man. I be reaching out to him and texting him and, and hitting him up. Like, he'll hit me back, but it ain't the same. Like, I'll be like, right. man, you come home? You come home? Okay, now that leads me to ask this question. Okay, which I feel I already know the answer, but I, I need someone else to weigh in on this. Do feelings outweigh facts? So you would think theoretically they shouldn't. Right, facts should always be. You know what I'm saying? What it is. But feelings come into play. Feelings gonna outweigh the facts because it's an emotion. It's an emotion. You know what I'm no, saying? No, okay, I, I I get what you're saying, but yeah. I'm saying, say for instance, like if a woman says, "I feel like this is your child," but then you like DNA said it did. It's not. But she looks like you to me. She's yours. She's yours. I'm talking about some feelings and facts type like. Well, in that or, case, or 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 do we like? Well, I feel like you cheated on me. And she be like, "But well, baby, the man said I didn't know. He doesn't know me." And I I took a polygraph test and it came back. I'm not lying. Yeah. But I still feel like you did. That's what that's so it, it, that's what I'm saying. So how opinion how, don't how outweigh, they outweigh the facts? Because it's an opinion. Somebody's opinion is always gonna outweigh what the truth is, especially. How, the, wait, wait, wait. How can an opinion outweigh the truth? Because you can't if if you co hold if co to the bar. Not, but I'm saying not a, but I'm saying an opinion, not what a person no, wants to be true. But I'm saying is like but I'm saying how I'm can feeling, it outweigh the truth? Feeling that way is still an opinion if it's true so, or false. So if I so that's like that's like we ain't gonna go into depth on it, but it's just like the the training stuff too. Like I feel like I'm a man or a woman. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That doesn't make you fat, even though you feel that way, right? Cause that's just like. But then this this and this the, the piggyback on that. People can say that and accept that. Yeah. But as soon as I tell the motherfucker I'm Cherokee and not black, I'm crazy. This is the same. I mean, <laughs> but I was, this is not. But this is not a feeling. Yeah. This is a fact. Like I, I'm, dude, this is not African. How many Africans you seen grow their hair down their back and change colors with the seasons? 
Yeah, no, because real Africans hair ain't that. No, I don't know a lot of the pictures that I've seen. But, but, not, but do they change colors with the seasons? You see no, what I'm saying? Like, 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 we change colors well, with the seasons. Well, they see real Africans, though. They seasons ain't like that. Like, my kids red. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But with the curly hair. But how, how many niggas went in Africa? The environment, got curly environment hair? is different. How many, now you talking about Jerry Curls. I know what I'm how, saying. The environment how, is different. That's why they don't but, the shades don't so change. So that's why you say that's why they ain't got no curl. They got nails. No, no, I'm saying they, they shades don't change because their environment doesn't change. Yeah, but they black already. I know, but they black but all year round. Because you don't have Once you get that dark, you can't lighten back up. I mean, Obviously. you can if you go to a cold environment. If you're so you if you go to a cold environment, you really think a black ass nigga gonna get light skin? He won't, but his kids might. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, it's evolution. Like, I mean, I'm with you, bro. I no, I'm saying, no, I don't see it because yeah. they, the sperm was cold when it came out. No, I ain't, no, nah, hell no. Nah. No, I'm saying, like, if you think about it, like, like, take Eskimos, right? But them Asians. Okay, but they used to being cold, like, so they their body has evolved to adjust and like through the through but the they years. But didn't change. Because it don't the seasons don't change. It's always fucking cold, and the snow is always there. Yeah. I don't know. I ain't no biologist. You know right, what I'm right. saying? But, but let's go back. Let's not get my own life's right. opinion. So so saying. back back to why you were saying uh uh uh, uh feeling can outweigh effect. How? That's like 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 I'm saying like I'm like some realistic real life shit like. Like, it's like if the police, I felt like you the one shot him. But the evidence says different. Yeah, but we have plenty of people that's locked up right now. But that's what I'm saying. But the feeling outweighed the fact. I I feel like it was you. I feel like you're lying, even though the polygraph said you passed. You're answering your own question. But I'm saying, but it doesn't outweigh it. It does if no one's a But they know better. They just decided to be a fucked up person. And that feeling outweighed the fact. But it wasn't. It really didn't. It just it did. If the they feeling, but it wasn't the natural feeling that you done. It's the feeling that it's the feeling of fuck you. It's not the feeling that you done the but, brand. And his it's feeling that, you know of fuck you and feeling that, like you did. That I got to the feeling that way the fact. Like I got to prove to society or to the people that we locked somebody up. It ain't about like right or wrong or what makes sense and just logical. Like I think that might be. I don't know if it's a flaw or what, but like I'm logical. I'm rational. I think. I, I question everything. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Just without trying. And if the shit don't make logical, simple sense to me, I ain't fucking with it. But that's is that how you feel or is that a fact? Cause I'm no, like, but I'm saying that's a fact. That's what I'm saying. That's how I am. Okay. Like, like I, I I learned that about myself and well, I embraced that. it. Let's take that, right? It's not a feeling. I know, but it, it's your fact. But that's what but your fact might not be my but fact. But no, that's what I'm saying. It ain't about no, yo, it, we ain't talking about perception or or, or it's view. The same or, thing. No, nah, we talking about fact. We talking about a fact, like you can say what you think it is and what you want it to. That's like if I see the apple right here. You can't tell me it's an orange. You can try, you can say, well, it's an orange to me. All day long. But the fact is, it's an like apple. Like you can't put a lemon cake in my face and convince me it's chocolate. Even if you put chocolate icing on it, you know what I'm I hope saying. Nobody does that. But I'm just saying, you feel me, bro? Like that. But that's I, feel, I feel that. But and, and, and I'm saying, and then like, say, for instance, if I like, if a, okay, if a fact don't affect or change your feeling, you know what I'm saying? What? So justify that for me. Like I'm saying, like say if you say if you got a feeling, then I can prove to you with facts that okay, that's not what it is. Then what? Then I have to go with the proven. But what if you choose not to? Then because just, you just say, well, I feel like it. Even even with the facts in my face, I still felt like you did. So to me, then the feeling I way the fact. But does it make simple sense? Is it logical? I mean, to me, it is. Well, bro, say, wait, bro, come in. Let me see. Read these comments. What, what do you say, bro? Feelings uh, what? Cool breeze coming. Feelings cloud facts, I believe. Exactly. T, but thank you, Breeze. Feelings he said cloud. It, that's, that's what I was saying. But I'm saying he didn't say outweigh. He's saying it cloud. 
Cause, cause people don't want to accept it yeah. because they don't want to have opinion. to change the way they feel right. because it's an right. opinion. Yeah. But I, but hear what I'm, but no, what I'm saying, that's what I'm getting at. So if you saying you feel this way without knowing the facts, right? Then you hear the facts and it, you refuse to accept them because now you have no validation to say why I feel this way. But if I feel that strong about it, then I'm gonna still stand on that. But even it. with the facts, I'm a, but I'm just saying, not me, but I'm saying, right, 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 right. I'm saying, so what? What's the gain from that? Like, let's just say this. So facts, right? Let's just say it's a chick that's like a known fucking cheater. It's facts. But then your homeboy is fucking with her, and you tell him like, bro, she's a known right, cheater. I right. feel like she's the one. But bro, here's a video of her from yesterday. I feel like I love her. I want to be with her. His feelings are outweighing the facts for in his personal situation. We're, we're, we're not not really that they outweighing them. It's just the nigga choosing to be a fool. But I'm just saying. You know what I'm saying? Like he like he like cause, like like I get what you're saying. Like he refused to accept the facts. And this and so that's what I'm saying. You, but, but I'm saying that's that what, but, what, so. but, but what I'm saying if you refuse to accept the facts. To to keep your feelings or your truth. You see what I'm saying? Because yeah. you, you want to try to say somebody mistreated you or done something to you or this happened. And you want you want other people to buy into it and feel like it and side with you. But then the person comes and says, but no, that didn't happen. I wasn't there. Or this, this was that. And they hit you with facts, like clear-cut facts, like Cut proof, like you can't deny it. Other people saying, "Nah, bro, that that's what happened. He he ain't the one punch you. It was his cousin, and you know, I feel like it was you because he feel he could whoop you or some shit like that. I feel like it was you done it. I just I, I'm gonna get you, and, and people telling him, "Nah, bro, he didn't do it." But that's that's what I'm saying. Like if somebody is mad, when a nigga show you a video. Uh, another nigga punching you. It ain't even him. And he got on the same clothes. And nigga said, well, I feel like it was him. Come on, bro. Listen. I'm saying, what What do you call that? What do you call that? Insanity. But, you know what I'm yeah. saying? I'm just saying, like, yeah. nigga, it's just crazy. But I'm just saying, like, it's when somebody feel that strongly about something, man, it's hard to or, convince them different. Or, or, or I just lie. Because who's to say they actually feel that way if they can't accept truth? Because like if you truly feel some way, you can accept truth. You see what I'm saying? If, if this is how I truly feel, I can accept truth and still fuck with it. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, 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 like these chicks out here, baby daddy booty hole been played with. They try to play like they ain't, you know, or oh, he ain't this mad at real. Or nigga call a nigga all this or he ain't. They 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 try to convince themselves he ain't. Yeah. But then there's somebody else on the flip side who like, I'm gonna accept the truth. I, I I defended him. I said he wasn't what he is, but I'ma still choose to fuck with him. See what I'm saying? But another motherfucker, oh that ain't happened. But it's a video, baby. Yeah. You see? Like, oh my baby that my nigga ain't no snitch. He proper. He put well, baby, he got a whole mixtape, 30 minutes. Tell him yeah. everybody. <laughs> Feel me? Yeah, yeah. Nigga told him the bus driver. You know what I'm saying? Told him the family dollar guy from keeping the change. Everything. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He ain't know about What I'm saying, but so again, man, that's an individual. Yeah, but, but, but if you refuse to accept, I'm, I'm saying, what is it called if you refuse to accept it? To just try to justify the way you are naive. or the way you feel. Now, that's not naive. Is, well, now, naive is because you don't know. Yeah. You know, you know, and you just refuse to accept it. What is that, bro? What's like? Can somebody, if you're watching, please Google and let me, because I don't want to Google right now. What is, what is it? What is a person I'm called? Google. I want to know. Bro, I'm finna Google. I want to know. Yeah, yeah. Wanna know that. yeah a, person, <laughs> a person called. I don't, I don't who who refused to accept facts over feelings, like. The, I mean, you know what I'm saying? The I mean, if you basically define it already, it's insanity. It's basically like running into a brick wall. It's like, like a narcissist or something like that. Ain't that's it? what that is. That's, that's a mean. narcissist. Nah, that's, 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 that's a narcissist. 
No, it's insanity. Insanity. Well, the insanity is. But well, that's going, doing the same thing, expecting oh, a different, different result. result. Right. That's basically what that is. Denialism. Denialism. You deny Denialism is a person's choice to deny reality as a way of avoiding the psychologically uncomfortable truth. Bam. That's. That's what the word I'm looking for. The more you know. We learn something new. We learn tonight. Denialism. Denialism. Read this shit one more time, bro. What are you doing, Mario? Read this shit one more time. I got it. Denialism is a person's choice to deny reality Mm -hmm. as a way to avoid a psychologically uncomfortable truth. Uncomfortable truth. Denialism. Wow. D E I am not I wasn't expecting to be. I wasn't Ism. an honor student. Whatever. Ism. You know. We know what N A I is M. Yeah, so it's some bullet it's, it's, it's some shit. Anything in with ism is is very right. powerful. Denial <laughs> is, 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 is that a, that's a condition is that a condition? Yeah, I think it is. is that, like you said, like a diet of condition or Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, uh in the psycho in uh, psychologic I can't fucking read right now. Right. In the Psychology of a human behavior. I mean, psychology. Damn, I can't. I sound like fucking Tony. <laughs> Shout out to uh, Terrence Shepard Express. 
Uh, my homie Lee. Shout out to Soul Q. Hey, the little homie Joe Sims, man. Oh yeah, Joe, Joe, you know what I'm saying? My know? nigga, little Meechy driving them trucks. Yeah, hey, oh yeah, they, he just got his CDL too. Congratulations, hey, to Meechy. Big homie Tim Baker, man. Oh yes, sir. Yeah, Baker's college. Yes, Baker's sir. Bible college, man. man. We, we out here, man. We around a bunch of sisters. We out here, man. Hey, the hood done pretty good. Hey, man, man. we doing pretty we good. We just the kids from Wilmo, baby. We done, hey, we done pretty you good, know, man. That's all, that's all it is, man, you know. But yeah, man, it's going down, man. Uh, uh, since, you know, we kind of late to it, but since, you know, it happened, we got to speak on it. But I want to speak on it from a different angle. Where you going with? Uh, mm. the, the whole... Chattanooga rapper that's on video, which I didn't see. I didn't have to see to believe it. You feel me? <laughs> uh, and it ain't even about just the video. Like, my question to you, bro, because the way it seemed to me, it was inside out instead of outside in. No pun intended. <laughs> <laughs> but, like, it seemed like it Chattanooga was the first to put it out there yeah. and then social media got in. It wasn't vice versa where, oh, it was on TMZ, it was on all these places, yeah, yeah. and then boom, chat know about it. So my question to you is, do you think it was some industry backlash or a motherfucker close to him locally or privately slow hating you know, or just trying, you know, or a publicity stunt on his end to boost shit. Cause they said the man doing numbers right now. Yeah, well of course he's gonna do numbers with the uh, the, the whole the, movement. Well the whole yeah the climate the of, the, of the society right now. Of course he was gonna do numbers. Um I don't feel I don't I, it might have been some hating shit. Um just and because it, it of, on the hate. Yeah, just yeah, just because of how from from what I heard, like the individual was like talking to the thing, like this is what it is. So it wasn't like it was unknown. It was like it was a known, like it was known that we're videoing. Mm. Um, so you know, all it did was elevate them. I hate the whole situation was crazy. Social, you know, social media blew it up. It was some funny shit. I ain't gonna lie, shit was funny as fuck. Some of the shit motherfuckers were saying. Um, I hate it though because of the way it came out. Like you should have gave them an opportunity to say. Well, this is what I social media. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, but I'm saying, you know what I'm saying. But, I mean, but that's but that's anybody. Like, like I'm telling you, bro, yeah. Like the same motherfuckers who celebrating us right now, and not just us, but anybody. Let a nigga be in the bus tomorrow. Oh yeah, they do yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, 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 like the home girl just open up her. Uh, uh, Peach cobbler, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That London, shit good. London. That's London. what I'm saying. Shit good. That shit oh, awesome. Good. That shit big. Yeah. But just say something small, or something random. If she was to get pulled over, suspended license, yeah. tailpipe out, some some bullshit. Chattanooga going, oh, motherfucker, you yeah. think you all that? Yeah, they gonna. You know gonna. what I'm saying? Like, like, my, shout out to my nigga Nate. Nate making big moves. Nate, Nate following, growing. Nate doing his thing. Yeah. Let some small, small mishap. Yeah. Like, and, and and I was watching the show the other day, bro. And it got me, that's what it got me thinking. Like, it was talking about basically like black athletes. You're great up until that one mistake. Yep. It ain't no room for error. That's, that's error. The pressure, the pressure on us is there's no room for error. You make one mishap, one mistake, and that outweigh all the work you done did. And I ain't talking about no fucked up nigga who just ref, you got caught doing some shit yep. you shouldn't been doing. You fucking with kids doing some bullshit. I'm talking about like, you're human. And some bullshit just come your way because you're trying to be different, you're trying to be great, you're trying to change. And then this thing you know, a motherfucker come at you just yeah. randomly. And like you, like, like you in the matrix and motherfucker turn to Agent Smith on you. What you supposed to do? You right. You know what I'm saying? They gonna crucify you though. But that's what I'm saying. Yeah, they gonna like, crucify like, you like, like, that shit. Is that just Chuck Lewis or is that everywhere? That's everywhere. It ain't, it's. It's bad here because we really here. Bad here. But because we here. Right. But it's like know each other. Yeah. Everybody knows each other. Everybody it's, three people from each other. That's that's life though. That's in general. It's a six right. degrees of right. separation. You know what I'm saying? Right. With with any of that. Because I I've seen people love a pick with a chick with a dude. Then love a pick with her and another dude, like less than a month apart. 
Yeah. I done seen them all the same people celebrate a person getting engaged or they wedding. Love it when they say they're getting divorced. You see what, like, yeah. shit is weird, bro. Social media got it like, like that. that that's why I came up with the whole, you know why I don't trust y'all. Because mm -hmm. I done seen people coming on two people who beef in statuses. You know what I'm saying? You know they talk about each other. Shit, yeah. And the motherfucker on both of them. For real, that's some real shit. shit. Yeah. And come back on, I know what you're talking about. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you should have seen what that nigga said yeah, about you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Damn, Damn, bro, I, ain't I, so, I ain't know y'all was into it like that. Because that nigga said, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, like to me, like, that's, that, that's weird, bro. That's weird. Because, like, what the next motherfucker eat don't make me shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm not studying it. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm not focused on I'm not paying attention whether you up or down. It doesn't bother me. You know what I'm saying? Because I ain't counting next motherfuckers pockets. No way. If I fuck with you, I fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? And if I don't fuck with you, I don't fuck with you. Yeah, and I don't have to. So don't, right, don't expect right, me to. Right. And, and if you got it going on or not, that doesn't change how... Oh, my nigga just hit the lottery. I'm going to fuck with him. No, I ain't that nigga. Yeah. You know, like I had, I had a nigga tell me, like, ask me straight up one time, cause I quit fucking with a nigga, and he was like, "So if he hit the lottery tomorrow for a hundred grand, and he told you he got thin ten thousand dollars for you, you wouldn't take it from him." I'm like, "No, I don't, fuck, I with don't fuck with yeah, him. I don't fuck with him." So I, 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 I don't see, see fuck what I got going see, on. See, that's the thing, man. Motherfuckers get caught up in a lot, a lot, a lot of people get caught up in material shit. What a motherfucker got, what a motherfucker don't get. Right. If you fuck with somebody, you fuck with them. Rather they up, rather they down, like you said, you fuck with them. And it's like people get so caught up in like I don't fuck with him. They dog him out, but let them get like you said, get some money. Now that's your best motherfucking friend. You know what I'm saying? And it's right. like. Oh, man, you know me and this nigga grew up together, bro. You know what I'm saying? My nigga right here, bro. Like, you just was talking about the nigga. You said you ain't fuck with us, but now, now you, you know what I'm saying? Holding yeah, these shopping bags and shit. What he say in the comments? He had to get rid of it. What's that? I missed that. It's it, it making jokes talking about, um, it, he was trying to figure out what you was talking about. He just didn't understand what you were saying. Oh, right? okay. Oh, okay. My, my fault, man. I speak Southern. That's, I told him it was yeah, something right. lingo. Yeah, hey, he didn't understand it's exactly hey, what I said. We I need a little exactly fucking closed caption. I, that's why I let you finish what you was talking about. I was going to say, man, 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 it pays, you know what I'm saying. Of course it's gonna pay, cause it's Chell Lou. Yeah. One thing, bro. It's social media, it's just so Well, not even just so Chell Lou. We known, bro, for the worstest, craziest, dumbest yeah. shit. Yeah, cause man. during the pandemic, nigga, the West Side was on motherfucking ESPN, nigga, for a block party, bro. I mean, not ESPN, but CNN yeah. for a block party. <laughs> shit. And then what about when the girl pissed in the family dog? <laughs> oh, so yeah, I'm like, I'm like, I don't like, get that. I, I yeah. promise, bro, thanks to Facebook, them memories pop up. You know, I make all memes of everything. So this shit popping up, I'm like, oh, man. Like, oh, like when the chick suck dick at mirrors. Like, all this shit coming up in my <laughs> memories, bro. And I'm just like, fuck. Oh, the pool team at KG's. Oh, it's all this shit popping up in my memories. And I, I'm like, nah, I, ain't, I can't be messing. But yeah. I go laugh or, you know, un yeah, un ha ha, un ha ha and re ha ha it. So somebody else will come in. I ain't gonna somebody lie. Else I ain't, I'm petty like that. That's funny, I, bro. <laughs> I un ha ha it and re ha ha it. Because I got thousands of followers and they let's know somebody is sharing is popping again. But this stuff happened. Like, Chad is known for some wild shit, bro. Yeah, yeah. Like, some real wild ass shit. Chad will go viral, nigga. Like, Marcus fighting in church. Yeah. All that shit. Man, like, man, 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 bro, I know everybody <laughs> involved. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm just like, this shit happened, bro. This shit that happened. shit was on shade, bro. This shit hit that all shit the fight. Everywhere. That shit went viral. That shit fight. everywhere. I'm like, where I be at? But hey, what's kind of went viral too? Uh, did some of Google graphic go viral in this? Yes, yes, yeah. yeah. That's 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 that's
He been, but they, if you know him, he been that way. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like that is like I, you know the jungles he Jamaican. Right. I, I swear, bro, nigga be at the club doing security. They just know he over there with the niggas dancing. Then, then he's a power bear. You know what I'm saying? Then he's a power bear. And then he used to uh, like bar, bar limousine to take people to the pro. All that shit. <laughs> all that shit. And nigga ain't nothing but a few years old than us. Hey, for, hey, I never forget. He went by first time. He went by recipes. Crystal, uh, rest in peace to Crystal, uh, nigga, she did that. Crystal Neal alive, bro. No, no, this, this is different. Oh, Crystal. other Crystal was not class. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You know, she passed away. Yeah, 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 yeah. I forgot this too. She, uh, she had posted it. No, no, she had posted that, uh, yeah. she had posted that you might be from Chet. She, her shit was like, you might be from Chet. If Tony Boston irk you. That shit had, that shit went viral. That shit had over 3,000 motherfucking dollars. I remember that. Yeah. I remember that. That shit went viral. That shit went viral, bro. I remember that, bro. I remember that post. Everybody from the city. Everybody was just posting shit. Everybody was commenting on that shit. I remember that. That shit was crazy, man. I remember that, man. I remember that. Man, for real. Like that it was shit yesterday. Crazy, man. That shit was crazy, bro. That shit but took the fuck off. Chat motherfucker, man. Yeah, yeah. I done seen this city suck niggas under. Like that ain't like if you ain't from chat and you come to this motherfucker, you better get the fuck out. Yeah. I'm telling you, you well, don't try to do the shit you was doing when you was, man, this, when you was at. Man, I promise, bro. Man. This shit happened, bro. This shit happened. I never forget it. I was in my twenties. I'm in my twenties, right? I'm in my twenties, bro. You know, doing the thing. You hear me? Right. Motherfucker come down here from Ohio, bad little chocolate chick, right? You feel me? And you know, we know who from here and who yeah, ain't. Yeah. You ain't from here. I meet her at Club Coffee. Bro, this motherfucker, you know, of course, script jump, shake jump. Shout out to Club Coffee. The best club chat ever. Man, we need another one. It was my crack cocaine, nigga. I spent four, five hundred dollars a week. Man, God damn, God damn coffee I had an issue, nigga. I had an issue. Man, I had an issue. If you love club, I was in Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, nigga. When you watch this, I you be out club, you miss club coffee, put a little coffee cup man, put a coffee in the comments. Put a coffee, coffee cup in the comments. Put a man. coffee cup in the comments. They just play out music and everything. Man, coffee yeah, was the so, shit. So, so this motherfucker, <laughs> hey, this motherfucker, bro, mm. this motherfucker, bro, I love the coffee. This club club, <laughs> man. Hey, my nigga Jersey used to come from Atlanta, nigga. Hey, hey, he was like, what, $5 left, Dad? <laughs> hey, nigga, $200 have a time in your life. Your brain's That's BYOB. 20, That's 20, 20 lap dances. It's BYOB. It's BYOB. 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 I'm talking about BYOB. Shout out to Dan Cook. 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 Shout out and the no, you the shit. <laughs> okay, so so this motherfucker in the coffin, right? Yes. She in the coffin, shaking her head, you know, of course, cause she worked there. Feel me? But she playing high to did it cause she ain't from the city. You feel me? Like she exclusive or some shit. Right, right. Bro, wait, no, no. I'm telling the story backwards. Let me rewind. So I saw this motherfucker out before, right? And she played Hasidim and shit, right? So, fast forward, I go with McDonald's on Brevin Road. Feel me? I think I was giving my kids some breakfast or some shit one morning. My cousin was the manager, so I used to go through. She take care of us. Love you, cuz. I ain't gonna say your name. You know who you are. So, because I can't tell on you, ain't no snitch. I love you, cuz. So, go through there and get the breakfast. I see girl and uh, Arguing with another manager, like, I ain't gotta take this. I could do better. Woo, 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 all this shit, right, bro? So, fast forward two weekends later, I'm at Coffee. This motherfucker working out now. <laughs> she said, so, she could do so, better, so she, yeah. but she would just have to do to try to have side, right? Of course. So, me being me, I buy it. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah come on, move. So, I'm sitting, I think it was me, maybe Mike G and Jay or somebody. We chillin'. Boom, boom, she on the nigga. Hey, I, I'm tipping. I said, bro, she still smell like fries. <laughs> 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 Turn around, saw who it was, bro. Got a 
y'all bought me some motherfucking fan. <laughs> but fast forward, a year or two later, that bitch was in a busted for prostitution 1.5 miles of the school zone, man. Oh, shit. Shout out to her. Hey, so that means. She so, thought, hey, that's she bald headed with a big nose and skinny, nigga. Look, I thought, oh, damn. 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 She I'm took thinking. your ass back to Ohio. This shit was left. God. Damn. She damn. was sucked her ass up. Oh, her ass, her titties, and everything else. So, man, this, that shit crazy, bro. Damn. It'll take everything. Chat the fuck, bro. There's so many people that ain't from here that's from here now. You can't come here from my get stuck. Side, you man. get stuck. Well, not that, man. You nah, can't you come. Stuck, yeah, bro. but. You get stuck. You get don't know how to no baby. You, 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 you can't come. You can't come. You can't come here. Chat up and do the same shit this, you were doing. This, I tell you, Chattanooga, Tennessee is Castle Rock. You don't watch that show. <laughs> <Yeah. right>? Chattanooga, <laughs> Tennessee is Castle. You watch that shit, bro. Shit. Watch <laughs> Castle Rock. That's fucking Chattanooga, Tennessee. The dumbest, <laughs> weirdest, spookiest, fucked up, sickest shit gonna happen here, nigga. <laughs> I'm telling you, you come down as motherfucker you want to. But I think, I think that's, I think, thing is Aquarium and all that shit. I think people fed up by ass. Shoot you at the Speedway on 3rd Street. You know what I'm saying? Cancun's gonna get your ass. It's gonna happen, nigga. It's gonna happen, nigga. I'm telling you. Chattanooga will fuck your ass up, what? But so many motherfuckers ain't from here that came to Chattanooga. Fuck they ass up. Man, like. Now they right just up. around. You know how them motherfuckers around here we call New York? You, you got like, yeah. Every nigga from New York here we call New York. Yeah. You know, every nigga I know from New York down here we call New York. Fucked up now. <laughs> That's one of the biggest cities ever. They yeah. still wear their Timberland boots and shit, but they fucked up. They need a light. They want 50 cents of change. You know what I'm saying? They breaking in the house. They on the ice. It's something like you got something up about little old Chalou. This motherfucker ain't no joke around here, man. You play with this motherfucker you want to. <laughs> man, I swear this whole goddamn city is built on a motherfucker in your burial ground. Like a cemetery. Like older guy or something. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pit Bull Cemetery. Right? <laughs> you special if you survive in here. Yeah. Oh, oh, hey, shit. salute to everybody that's making it in Chattanooga, Tennessee. Whether you're from here or you ain't, because we know. Y'all know I'm not lying. It, it bitches at your job hate you just because you worked up. <laughs> <laughs> bitch want to fight you. She will lose her job and fight you. It's niggas out here that'll hit your collar to fuck your shit up and tear us up at the same time. He don't yeah, care. Yeah. Just to fuck you up. This chat, bro. Hell Come on, bro. bro. Nigga don't want to see you with 50 cent more than him. That's crazy. Nigga will rob a nigga three dollars down. He ain't got no more than you. You shot me at Ed, man. Family Dollar, yeah. goddamn, motherfucking <laughs> You go to the hey, same hey, store. Hey, 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 go to the same hey, goddamn hey, store. Hey, 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 hey,
gotta come this motherfucker. Hold on. You gotta go down. God damn, boy. That nigga laid that shit out. God damn. Man. Shit. For real, bro. <laughs> damn. So that's how you really feel. Man, hey. Smile, smile, brightness is on music. It's a black power beat. Oh, shit. You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. For real, man. Man. Don't bring your ass to the chat. Don't bring it. Don't bring it. Don't come back. Yeah. If you made it out. Because <laughs> if you do, you'll be living at your mama house. They're going to take your license. You gonna get a pothole, nigga. You gonna fill up your rims. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, cause the chat go to jail for purges in, in, in ten months, nigga. God damn. That nigga, what? What that thing? We live from the back cave. Man, man. y'all feel me, bro? Like real shit, though. He has a point, but but right, come on, yeah. bro. We we from this motherfucker. Yeah. Like, like, just think about it. Our generation was fucked up. We was bad, but these motherfuckers now. That's something else. And, 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 and the kids now not living to tell about it, bro. My son got more dead homeless than me, bro. Damn. And that bothers me. Damn. That right. fucked up, yeah, because he, he just turned 18. 18. Yeah. Damn. These young niggas on some other shit. These young folks on some other shit. It ain't even about nothing or fun nothing. It's just like, cause nigga want a name. Nigga, nigga want nigga. These niggas never just want to be shared, liked on Facebook, you know, put on a shirt. Like shit weird, them, you know, bro. And the niggas who guide them, misleading them. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying like, cause we came up, we came up on niggas was about getting money. And so that was they pass on to us, right? Get money, right? But now, oh man, I don't know. But now it's just it's likes, like likes and shares yeah. and comments. It's the new crack cocaine. Yeah. Nigga slap your grandma on live for some likes, shares, and comments. Nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like, this shit weird. Everything is weird. It's the new norm. Another thing too that I noticed, man, uh, is and maybe maybe I'm maybe because I don't I don't have no young no kids in high school or nothing, but it um. Uh, it's like they don't be like interested in none of this shit. Like what we were like, we was interested in, you know, going to a game, talking to some girls, social media, kicking. but we didn't have social yeah, media. Yeah, you're right. But our, that's like our life as far as we could see, as far as we can reach. Now people based in their whole existence off motherfuckers they don't know, off motherfuckers who, and then they act like they can't separate. Like I said, fact from feeling. You can't understand this is staged. They're acting. They're, they, they, they're trying to get likes and comments. They're trying to get shares. But then you think this is real life. This is like, like what's the little nigga? Dre, who baby mama be punching on him and all that shit. And he be dancing, doing that shit. It's a, it's a little young nigga. Baby mama punching on him. Oh, he was singing some little song. Baby mama got the fine on him. He went viral for the shit. Now he got a following and shit, but he always doing something. Remember, like your boy, uh, what's the name? Boom Gang or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it's like shit weird now. Whereas people like, nigga, I don't give a fuck what I do, who I got across. I need this sensation. I need this fix to feel like love, mm. attention. Nigga, wake up. Nigga, I got 50 shares. I got 100 comments. I got 300 likes. And they make you feel like you somebody. Nigga, be ready to quit their job. Why? Wow. Man, I'm Instagram fame. I'm so full Facebook fame. But if you don't know how to turn that shit into revenue. Yeah. And most of them don't. Like, I don't have plenty of people see me out and be like, hey, Facebook friend. I'm just like, I don't even know what the fuck this is. I have literally no clue. Yeah. Because for one, they probably catfish. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Lil Mark, we be out. Somebody speak to him. He's like, damn, who is that? They feel like they know no, him. Because yeah. they've been telling them happy birthday the last 12 years on Facebook. She, but I, but I, I call it and I'm like, damn, this is the new normal. Well, basically, and it, this just led me into something else. I feel like they was teaching us social distancing before social distancing. 
We talked about this what last one last you know what I'm saying? We talked about this. Yeah, but like, you know, that's that's like cause like folks really felt like they knew him. Yeah. Cause you telling the picture happy birthday. And it's on my page, so he ain't he wasn't on social media at the time. Mm. He ain't saw that shit. He don't know you. Like, I, like I'm, 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 I'm glad I slowly, gracefully, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Cause, Cause now kids six, seven years old and got a motherfucking yeah. iPhone 59. You know what I'm saying? You know, <laughs> Man, nigga phone got them and got them unlock a lock and start a car and everything. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit done changed. Like, I'm glad I was, you know, I, I let him age gracefully. Yeah, love being kid. Yeah, love my kid. nigga got yeah. a whole beard now. Yeah. But he still ain't like, just disrespectful. I told him, you know I told him, bitch, I said, my nigga, like, he probably home with us. You know, so that full beard. Is like, hey, listen, I don't cut my shit like this. This had grow. <laughs> and I'm thankful for it. Yeah. That's the iron of life. When you young, you want to be old. When you're old, you want to be young. Ain't that some shit? Yeah. I'm just saying. Like, I've been like to put my stepdad a brood on and shit. For 10 years. Yeah. I ain't put my and, granddad a brood and on. And things going to make my shit grow. <laughs> but I wasn't yeah. no P-boy, so I wasn't eating pussy in school. Ha! <laughs> Pun intended. <laughs> Pun intended. Y'all know eating pussy already. Uh, <laughs> hey, I ain't gonna really lie, though, nigga. I wish I would. That's what I was going to say. If I knew what I knew, I knew. If I knew what I knew, I knew. If I knew what I knew, I knew. Can I, and then, then, then 
somebody said, now we out here can't get enough pussy to eat. Right. <laughs> you hear me? You hear me? Hey. 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 Give me some pussy chicken, weed, little Hennessy. I'm straight. Hey. And some toothpaste. What the hell is Come on, man. Man. But that's another story. We, we, we're trying to bring this shit back in. Man. Bear with us, y'all. Bear with us. <laughs> Bear with man, me. Man, this shit, man. Man, fuck you, why I don't get this shit. Nah, that's loud. Not this one? Okay, we'll wait. We'll wait. I guess we are. We'll wait till we get the home phone. We, 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 we gotta get another one of the home phone. Come in, then. Yeah. Come in. Put that bitch into the best head you got in your life. Cause we wild. Tag on Facebook. Tag it. Tag on If you a bad bitch, tag it. 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 Tag you got yeah, your head, head. Yeah. like, yeah. Hey, right now, hey, wait, but that's what's crazy, though, because you get grown, then you realize women just as freaky as me. Oh, yes, yes, sir. Like, like, it's like, like I'm saying that, that's right. 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 They try to say we wrong, because all we want to do is fuck them and this, that, and the other, but I'm sitting here like, but it's women out here who can't get nobody to fuck them. You ought to be glad that your nigga want to fuck right. all the time. He wants to just be with you. He wants, you know, like, yeah. that's a blessing. It's women out here buying dick. It's women out here that's actually on these phone call hotlines. Yeah, yeah, these date sites. Right. It's, just one it's, it's, it's women out here playing with themselves. And they can't because they want nobody to fuck them. A lot of shows, uh, somebody, they don't throw the tag in for somebody. Oh, let's go. Oh, let's go. Oh, 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 tag me. Oh, 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 
Let me look at the. Let me look at the. T I'm waiting on it to catch up. This shit don't work. I'm waiting crazy. on it to catch up. Look at my lips. I'm too young for this. <laughs> I'm just turning around. I'm too young. I need those hair bars. Wait, I'm getting lower. Oh, this nigga getting lower. He's making the fight. He's making the fight. I'm too young for this. I'm too young for this. I'm too young for this. Remember the Love call me, me more. 